hello guys and welcome back so now we have the reloading system and we have completed all of the player animations as you can see he can walk and he can run he can also jump and he can also play the fire fire animation as you can see now he is reloading and okay we have different types of animations now so the next thing we want to do is to play the remaining animations so as you can see we don't aim when we press the mouse right button we want him to play the aim animation so we have already assigned all of the animations as you can see we have this aiming idle and all of that okay as you can see we want to play this animation so for that open up the rifle script okay we need to assign some animations right here as well and and on this switch camera as well so let's start from this switch camera script right here first of all what we want to do we want to play the aim animations okay so if we are firing and also we are walking with it we want to play the aim walk animation okay so for that at the top we will simply first of all create a header and name this as a camera animator and then we will type public animator and let's name this animator and now let's assign this animator so in the unity now if we come right here as you can see in the switch camera we need to just drag and drop the animator and let me change this to back to normal now we have the headings and all of the thing okay so now we have assigned the animator now right here when we are shooting and we are walking we want to make the idle animation false okay because we are no more in the idle animation and also we don't want the idle aim animation because we are walking okay we don't want to play the idle aim animation or actually if you think right here we are still firing no 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 sorry we went uh, wrong right here this is the fire 2 button which is the aim button the mouse right button so if we are aiming and we are walking with the aiming then we want the idle to be false but the idle aim to be true okay so we will set that to true and after that the aim walk animation will be also set to true and right here we will also set the walking animation to true so set the walk to true okay so this was for this if condition now in the else if what we will do we can actually just copy all of that paste it down below and right here we don't want the idle to be true so we will we just leave it as false okay and as you can see this is just for the aiming so when we are just aiming then we want to make the aim walk false and also we want to make the walk false again we just want the idle aim to be true okay and then in the else block right here what we will do we can actually copy that three paste it down below leave this fourth one which is the walk one okay and set the idle to true and then the idle aim will be set to false okay when we are not aiming and also we are not walking then we want to make just the idle true the idle aim false and the aim walk as well false 
so these were just some basic animation for this so now we can simply just save this okay and let's test how this animation work so get back to unity and now let's play the game make sure that you assign the player animator okay now as you can see we can simply aim when we press the mouse right button as you can see now we are aiming and now we are not aiming we are aiming not aiming aiming not aiming okay we can walk and when we are walking and now if we want to aim so if you click on it now as you can see he is aiming and he's walking he's playing the aim walk animation okay let me show you that side to side by showing you the animator so let me close the game let just make this animator okay let me move it right here now whoops i think i need a bigger screen now because as you can see a lot of stuffs are not fitting inside the screen okay i think this will be enough now if we try to play the game okay make sure that you click on the player okay so now as you can see it is playing the idle animation now it is play, playing the idle in the idle aim okay we are now aiming and when we try to shoot as you can see it plays the fire animation as you can see okay now when we leave everything we are back to the idle we can walk and now if we want to aim and now if we click on the fire 2 button now as you can see he is playing the aim walk and also the walk okay and if we try to shoot as you can see now he is shooting Okay, so he's aiming, not aiming. He's walking, aiming, not aiming. He's now just playing walking, now aim walk. Walk, now aim walk. As you can see. So this is how you can add different animation. Now he plays the jump. You can, okay, I press the control button. Let me click the shift, sorry, the escape button and notice this transition okay when we try to shoot as you can see now it is playing the reload okay he is now playing the shoot now the reloading now he is back to shooting okay now he is back to idle now if we try to jump as you can see now when he plays the jump we are back to the idle so i hope you understand this animation thing okay in unity and if you have any questions you are free feel free to ask me and I will try to answer as many as I can. I hope you like this video and see you guys in the next one.